So this is the, the mock-up of the Viewtag wheel, where we show how uh, in a real life uh, the Viewtag wheel will be rid uh, to, to, uh, to uh, show for the, for the ground crew that the Viewtag unit is in operation. Because as you know, uh, the, uh, the Viewtag provides for uh, the aircraft to go reverse from the gate and taxi forward, taxi out, taxi in uh, after the landing. So it has to show for, for the ground it's on because uh, uh, the aircraft will actually move silently uh, on, on the ground with no tack uh, adjacent to it. So it's a new uh, technology for the airports as well. And you'll also have uh, this we, we, flashing we, light? We, we get uh, the wiring uh, which will flash uh, also. The, the, this is going to be the wire harness uh, uh, which uh, of course brings power from the APU rectified in, in the eBay for the, the Viewtag wheel. Uh, and also it will be illuminated uh, to, to indicate for, for the ground uh, crew and for the other aircraft that the aircraft is moving under the good power. Okay. Okay. Let's move ahead and uh, uh, see how uh, Viewtag will impact right. on the airport uh, um, uh, operations. So you see on, on this model how uh, the aircraft comes to the gate, nose in. This is normal, this is like uh, today. Aircraft comes and in, and, but here it starts. Uh, the aircraft turns 90 uh, degrees, so it parks parallel uh, to uh, the terminal. And uh, the gate uh, can use two bridges to disembark and embark the passenger. So doing this uh, twist operation, uh, this is how we, we call it, this new ground maneuver, uh, we can cut up to 20 minutes from the ground time of the aircraft, which is extremely important, especially for the low-cost carriers. Low-cost carriers, nowadays, they spend 40-45 minutes at, uh, on the ground, just wasting time for, for, for the airlines, uh, because they want to fly the aircraft rather than uh, sit uh, the aircraft on the ground. Uh, with a twist maneuver, we can cut up to 20 minutes uh, from the ground time on a single flight, which means... That's potentially up to 50%? That's potentially 50% of the ground time. Uh, so it means all uh, from the touchdown to, to, the, uh, to the takeoff. For the low-cost carriers, but not just for them, this is such a significant saving, which will multiply the fuel savings. The uh, view tech, the technology will uh, will uh, lower by default. But everyone thinks first, uh, uh, speaking about Viewtag, this is all about fuel. This is about the fuel, but uh, more importantly, this is about the time we save for uh, the airlines on the ground. Okay? Uh, the impact of uh, the, uh, the technology on the airport operations we show on the simulation. Uh, this is a side by side. Uh, simulation where we show the Viewtag aircraft side by side with the non Viewtag aircraft uh, and the impact on, on, the, on the airports. So you see on, on the simulation the, the Viewtag aircraft coming uh, and dancing at the airport and then uh, on the next uh, uh, side you see the non Viewtag airport and we, de we done a comparison uh, uh, the same number of the aircraft versus uh, uh, the same number of the non wheel aircraft and realize that uh, uh, with this uh, you can save about 10 to 20 percent uh, of the uh, airport uh, uh, time uh, in, in, in total. So these are very uh, significant changes, all significant changes next to uh, emission savings, pollution savings, uh, uh, also the, the, the FOD savings, which Vudak uh, will generate on the ground anyway. Thank you. You're very welcome. Mm -hmm.